we're back with more Metroid Dread! Yeah. All right, maybe we should talk about that uh, direct update now, shouldn't we? It's, Sounds it's been, good. It's been Actually, some time, uh, you know. I think we already saw an improvement. The loading times are a bit quicker. They are indeed. All right, we're at Eloon. We got to get the stuff here, yeah. This is a small place. It's very small. So again, we'll be trading off every time we get a power-up of any kind, and uh, we'll just keep going until we find a good stopping point. Yep, just go until we get the thing that... You, what, what he said. I so uh, when that. are you doing dread mode? Well, let's, you know, talk, let's talk about that. If you don't know, uh, there was recently a an, an update for Metroid Dread. Eh, I probably have to go the other way through there. There was, there was an update for Metroid Dread. They added two new game modes. Rookie mode, which is easier easy mode, and Dread mode, which is way harder hard mode, better known as one-hit kill mode. See, I've heard rookie mode being called baby mode, and I have heard dread mode called I hate myself mode. Yeah, it's di it's difficult. There's there's no lie there. It's a one hit kill mode. It's it's a challenge. The auto saving is uh, th th they're nice enough that you'll probably be okay, but it's it's still really hard. Mm-hmm. And since a lot of these bosses are reliant on very precise movement. Uh, you're probably going to be dying. A lot. Yeah, probably. Now, I'm glad that they added rookie mode. Uh, basically, you just get more health from everything, basically. Uh, enemies still die the same rate, but you're just getting a lot of health back. So that's good for people who are getting back into Metroid and need a quick refresher. Or, you know, if you're having a rough time. There's a boss mo uh, a boss rush mode coming later. That's in April. That I think we'll probably do to end the series on just a nice end cap. Yeah. Now, hearing that Metroid Dread got an update actually surprised me, because this is, in all intents and purposes, a complete product. They it's, don't need to add anything. Didn't surprise me too much. You know, free update to drum up more uh, more interest, I suppose. I don't know, the game's already had plenty of interest. Well, there's a little more. Where's all the wow, stuff? nowhere to go. Yeah, where's all the stuff? We just went around in a big circle. Or maybe I do need to go through there. I would say so, yeah. Seems like the best option at the mo -ment. mo how do, I, how do I get back? Oh, You've got on. a long way to go. Ah, uh, I just gotta go around again. Sheesh! Well, well, why don't we go Sheesh. down? Why don't we go down into the right? Down here, to the right. No, no, the, the other right. Go up and over again. Okay. Well, while we're doing that, uh, can I talk about uh, a fun thing I purchased? What do you got? Well, almost immediately after the last Dread episode uh, was recorded, where we were talking about Federation Force. Oh, yeah. I bought it. And so, uh, fuck! Funny story. It was next day Amazon delivery. Perfectly fine. I kind of expected that. They had plenty of copies left. Also, imagine that. I, I'm not surprised. Oh no, me neither. What surprised me was I was given the notification that was delivered to my door. The package at my door was not for me. I've had that happen. It was delivered to the wrong person, which, in a comedic, uh, uh, comedic opportunity for me, not even the Amazon person wanted me to get my copy of Metroid Federation Force. <laughs> do you really want to? Do, do you really want to do this to yourself? Like it was. Ask a, yourself. It was a couple doors down, and like I had their package, they had mine, so I had a couple people just looking at me. It's like, what are you doing? It's like, no, 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 no. It's it's for them. They have my thing. I got uh, a Lady Gaga CD for Violet one time and uh, Amazon delivered it and it's like all right here it is and I pull open I, I take the package rip it open and pull out a leather bracelet <laughs> <laughs> that check again a few doors down Oops. oh well shit oh well shit. sorry oh, shit -oh. actually I do remember I had had ordered a lot of amiibo cards and somebody else had gotten it so, uh, uh, is it just a normal thing where people don't look at the address or name on there? 
I'll, I'll give the Amazon workers some credit. They're 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 got a lot of shit to deal with. Oh yeah, I know. But just seeing that this weird dude who would never order amiibo cards just look at me and said, "Hey, sorry, man, I accidentally opened it." <laughs> I accidentally took your Isabel. No, not the Isabel. Not the summer one. That's the best. We only apparently there's only four items in this entire area. So I'm is just that, Is that all? Did we, did we, did yeah, because we, we went from 25% to 50%. Oh, yeah. Cool. Yeah, we're halfway done. So where the hell are the rest then? <laughs> yeah, so it looks like the next one. I'm gonna just head down here. Yeah. And then in that corner over there. So I think you need to keep going through there. Keep going. Yeah. Keep, oh, through, keep all the keep way going, through here. Keep going through there. Because that'll take oh, you down shit. there to that area we haven't discovered, and then I'm probably gonna get that flashing white area. All right. And then we can move on. Now, on the flip side of that story, where I actually legitimately bought totally stone cold sober Metroid Federation Force, uh, kind of even out the balance of the universe. I also picked up Kirby Planet Robobot, which uh, surprisingly I did not own. You just got the worst Metroid game and one of the best Kirby games there. In indeed. Uh, balanced. Perfectly balanced, as all things should be. Alright, yes. Now, uh... I just noticed something here. I'm gonna give UDJ the box so he can look at it. Uh, what does that say on there in the bottom right-hand corner? Uh, yes, this is a very unique situation. It's so unique that it actually happened twice. Twice, yeah. So, uh, this is the same situation when uh, we picked up the Nightmare and... Dr Return, yeah, to, uh, uh, Return to Dreamland yeah. uh, box. This is the... United Arab Emirates, Saudi Arabia, slash Malaysia, Singapore release. Still has that E for Everyone rating. Still has E for Everyone. Oh, 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 drop, drop in the box. It is essentially entirely similar in every shape and way to the original North American, except for maybe some inserts. But yeah. even, even then, that's still yeah, kind of the, the, the same. Yeah, there's no inserts. They're practically the same. Yeah, it's like, you know, like, if you have problems, don't, uh, you know, you, you, you call... This address in Singapore or, or UAE or uh, maybe a Al Magalia Commercial Center. Oh you know? yeah, that, make, that makes right, sense. Right, right, yeah. But everything else is it, it's the same. English yeah. and plays on North American consoles. It's all it's all the same. Oh, did you I get got, one? I got a power bomb. Oh cool, 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 cool. Uh, yeah. So that is just so strange to me that that happened because it is still a North American copy. The only thing that's different on it is just a little tab in the bottom right hand corner that says it can be played in Saudi Arabia. Malaysia, Singapore, calling it an official product, which already makes me, you know, skeptical. Like, why do you have to tell me that it's an official product? But I've tested it out of my 3DS. Because people like us would be skeptical. Oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, so I tested it out of my 3DS. Works perfectly fine. It's It, it kind of reminds me of the uh, PS3 version of uh, Okami that I have. That oh, was... that, that's the... Uh, it's an English copy, but you got it from PlayAsia, I think. Uh, is that no, right? I, I, I just got it from Amazon, actually. But it is, oh, really? It is uh, indeed a uh, Hong Kong slash. Uh, That's right. Yeah, it's it's a Hong Kong version, I think. So it's got Japanese text, and the Japanese is an option. Oh dear. <laughs> okay. God. Okay. All right. How so. How do you do this? All right, this one should be easy. Oh. So, that down here. Slide, and slide, slide, and oh, okay. So okay, Almost. I see what you've done. Just gotta whittle down a little bit. Yeah, right. I see what you've done. Okay, this will be easy. That's actually awesome. So, yep. Yep, right over. And slide, there, and slide, there, and then boom! Right, right in there. Easy. Perfect. Now, double checking my math, that should be everything. That's everything. Hell right. yeah! Here you go. Let's get out of here. Yep. Find the next place to go to. GTFO. Let's go. Actually, uh, where should we go? Let's get foe to get mo. We're we going to Gavron. We got Gavron. We got Gavron. So, uh, Ferenia? Yeah, we can go to Ferenia. All right, go to Ferenia. So E to F. Off we go. Yeah. You picked up any uh, games lately that have had weird labels on them? <laughs> hmm. Or is it just me? I'm kind of digging through my old. Uh, through my library to, you know, play some old things and all that. So, uh. There's not a lot of games in my collection I have never, ever played or put into my console. Hmm. I, don't, I don't have a lot of those. Well, a few days ago, I uh, made good of that and got decently into a game that I had purchased 15 years ago for the Wii. Oh. And have never played until just then. 
Now I'm trying to think of what that could be. What could that be? What could it be? I, I, uh... I don't think I have it. No, you don't. It is a game that... Yeah, no. You do not have this game. That's amazing. One of the rare games that I have that you don't. It's not Solo to Robo, because that was a DS game. Dark Rise Fantasia? No, Harvey I have that one. Birdman, Attorney at Law. <laughs> <laughs> and the uh, the end result? <laughs> Did you really need I've Ace been, Attorney in your life that much? So I've been uh, I've been watching clips of Smiling Friends, that new show on Adult Swim. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm I'm very hit and miss when it comes to Adult Swim. Sometimes their shows are pretty funny. Hey, this 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 is good. Sometimes it's just obnoxious poop shit. It for happens. For example. Not a Rick and Morty fan, not an Aqua Teen Hunger Force fan, big Boondocks fan. I can see that. So Smiling Friends is, uh... It, it's, it's a show that's done by a lot of old Newgrounds, uh, alumni. That's partially the reason I want to watch it. Newgrounds was my, my teenage years, basically. And, uh, it, it's, it's still got that Adult Swim, uh, sheen of grease on it, if you know what I mean, but... It's, it's, it, it's very funny. I'm having a lot of fun. So I'm thinking, maybe I should uh, give some of these Adult Swim shows that I remember kind of liking back in the day, but because I was too young to understand most of it, I didn't, so... So I popped in Harvey Birdman, Attorney at Law, and... <laughs> yeah, it's pretty funny. <laughs> I had some good laughs. There's, there's some really good jokes in there. I, I, I enjoy it. I think my favorite joke is the one where uh, George Jetson and his son come in to, for, for a case. <laughs> It says, hello, fu hello, uh, primitive life being, we come from the future. Harvey's like, uh-huh, and, uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> what year yeah. do you come from? <laughs> George Jesse goes, the distant year of 2002. Then he looks at his, his <laughs> counter, this says 2004. <laughs> so, mm-hmm, well. <laughs> no, okay, okay. It's funny with every passing year as time... Yeah, as time goes by, Time yeah. makes that joke even funnier. 2002! Yeah, and it's 2004 here. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Well. Yeah, yeah, sure. See, I, the thing that surprised me when I saw that game on shelves was the fact that Capcom did it. And it makes so much sense. Yeah, Capcom published it. It was published actually it. made by High Voltage Games. What else did they do? Oh, they've done a whole bunch of things. I think they're still around, so that's a good thing. They didn't hire some, you know... Backwater. You know, we've yeah. only done two mobile games that got and, moderate and, success, and, and now we're games. and now we're working on a console port. Oops. No, no, this wrong, is wrong way. this is a high voltage uh, games. They've, they've they've done a bunch of stuff down the side to the right. I know they've done some things. I can't think of any off the top of my head. That's all right. But they, but they made it with Capcom's approval. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's it's, it's kind of funny. Well, they they kind of already had the, the the courtroom thing down, so I wonder if they borrowed some of Capcom's notes. The soundtrack's not bad. Kind of works the same way as Ace Attorney does. There is a, it's it's very, you know, watered based, down. Yeah, based on very Ace watered Attorney. down. But that's not a bad thing. It's it's meant to be a humorous uh, version of the show. It, it, uh, it's 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 supposed to be a funny game, okay? That's fine. Ace Attorney itself was funny. It was, yes. That's that's hilarious. I wonder how much Harvey Birdman is. You're gonna make me end up buying this. It's like 15 bucks. That's I, it? I was like, ooh, what if I have like a rare gem for the Wii that nobody thought- It's- it's fucking yeah. penny. No. You, no, you need to start investing in weeb trash in order to have, uh, some very rare games. But I hate weeb trash. Yeah, it's I know. trash for weebs! I know. Isn't it great? No, it's not! <laughs> and yet, some of my rarest games are in fact weeb trash. Which is ridiculous. Because they don't make a lot of them. That's why. So if you manage to snag a copy, there you go. Sweet investments. I'm finding that anything Nintendo is worth stuff. Oh yeah, that's they're still worth an arm and a leg. Oh yeah, that's that's the Shine Spark puzzle. Your turn. What, this one? The, the yeah, the one in that corner up there. Oh, well, I don't want that. I even know how to do that one. Oh, is it right here? It's uh all right, go over. You're gonna love this one. Who? I already don't like it just because you know Shine Spark puzzles. Uh, and this one's this one's one of the nastier ones. Oh, you have to Shine Spark. Okay. Clear the way. Cross bomb over, and then Ball Spark up there. You really having me do this one? <laughs> I can do it if you can. Oh. Like you have to. 
Oh, okay. you, you have to launch yourself what, after, right after you set the power bomb, basically. Otherwise, you're gonna lose the spark or it's gonna come back. Oh, it's, gross. It's pretty nasty. Okay, so I, I need to memorize the controls here, because that's always been my crutch. Or, not my crutch. My Achilles heel. Totally different. So... Oh, launch immediately after using the power bomb is what you said. Okay. Like you, you have to use a cross bomb to get over there though, and then you have to plant another power, uh, another regular bomb to break those, and then like right after you drop it, you launch it, and then when it explodes, that's when you launch. Okay. So, build, build up. It's oh. <laughs> have fun. Have fun with that one. Who wants a three-hour episode of Metroid Dread? All right, let me think. So I don't want to respawn the enemies. So it has to be done in here? Uh, you, you can go through that door, I think. It'll be fine. Let me test this theory. Oh, okay, they don't come back. Okay, that's good. At least they throw me that bone. Do that. All right. Shit. And you've lost it already, I'd yeah, say. Yeah, I lost it already. I keep going for that, for the right trigger in order to go down into more fall. I know that's not right. I know, it's like you have to do a muscle memory. All right. There's one so, Shine Spark in particular that's going to be a lot of, like, Shine damn, Spark. I think you can even, like, on your way over, you can just probably free aim and shoot those things right there. On the way over, okay. So you Shine Spark, store it, shoot those blocks. Ah, okay. Yeah, okay, that, that'll be yeah. the way to do it. Save yourself a little bit of time. Cross bomb. Okay. Well, all right. L let's not be blocking the door, okay? <laughs> okay. That's rude. Oh, well. Shit. Yeah, almost. It almost seems like the cross bombs aren't working entirely. I don't think they're implemented the best. You don't need the power bomb though, that'll take too much time. You'll never well, make it. How do you do a cross bomb normally? Let me try it. Just because this is a particularly nasty one. Yeah, am I, Let's see. am I just doing cross bombs wrong? I thought you had to use the uh R. Okay. Can I do that? Yeah. Yep, and there we go. Stop there. Uh, well, we, no, that's not it. <laughs> we are in ball. I repeat, we are in ball. Kind of wish sometimes I could use the D-pad. Oh. Damn it! All right, here we go. Stop there. Fuck! What are you trying to do? Keep going down too much. I need to <clears throat> focus up. Come on. And boop. Got that. Yeah, it's Can already gone. Yeah, uh, yeah. So I got a little time like that down, basically. Oh my. I, d I don't like Shine Spark <laughs> puzzles. They all suck. This one, this one's a really nasty one. There we go. Shoot. Cross bomb. Yeah. Yeah, why? Mer Mercury Stream, what are you doing? So, do that. <laughs> <laughs> when all else fails, just smash right into a door, it's fine. Like that! Oh my god! Like that! Mmm! Okay, I stand corrected. You are, in fact, the Metroid Master. Whew. I'll take that as your turn. That's fine. Yeah, take it. Because next one's probably going to be like, piss easy. I <laughs> wouldn't want to do that to you. Oh, we conveniently ran into another Shine Spark puzzle. UDJ, oh, wow. I need your oh, help. No. What are we going to do? Oh, where are we heading next? Uh, yeah, right there is good. Big old flashing area. Oh, heading up. I think this is just a simple power bomb. Oh. You didn't uh, want uh, to save it for me? <laughs> 
<laughs> you can get the next one. Oh, okay. There we go. Hey, right, that's new. All right. All right. See that? Thank you. Uh, twenty-one percent. Oh my gosh. Yeah, there's a lot of items here. Long way to go, but that's okay. We also didn't get very many while we were here. Nah. Oh, how about there? Oh yeah. There we go. So a lot of open space there. Over to the right. Off we go. What was your favorite part of the direct? Like uh, that wasn't the Metroid Dread. I had, a, I had a lot of favorite parts. I'll tell you what my least favorite part was. What's that? Platoon three. Why? It, it's the same thing. It's the exact same thing, except they added new bosses. Why do I gotta buy another game for that? I don't get it. Well, they've added new stuff to the Salmon Run. It's new stuff that you couldn't add in another DLC pack for Splatoon 2. Oh, I don't know. I gotta Probably. pay 60 bucks so I can have the same thing, except just a few more things. Well, let, let them present their evidence. It's still the never release date. I'm being a little overly cynical about it, but that's just how I feel right now. <laughs> I'm sure they will have a reason for all the things they are doing. And if they don't, well then it's just lost cause. Splatoon is dead. If I have to get into my picky, baby, stupid gamer bullshit, that'd be about it. There's something hiding around that I know it is. Yeah, there is, but I don't know how to get to it. And I have destroyed it, so I can't see it anymore. Hmm. Uh, Maybe there's another way well, to enter it from I over there. Yeah, I kind of see it. Over to the left, you yeah. think? Yeah. Yeah, I see an opening there. There's gotta be something here. Let me in! Let me in! Really? Still nothing? Maybe to the left some more. Through that door. Even more to the left? Yeah! Oh! 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 Gross! Outstanding! Shit. So, yeah, it's my turn. This one's pretty easy, though, because you just... Don't say easy before I've done it! Well, compared to what you have to do, this one is just... Oh, yeah, this, is this, just this is actually very easy. Build up, and then uh, ball spark, and that's it. And that's Why not how you... did it work? Oh, Jesus she Christ. She didn't ball spark. I was trying! Well, you gotta try how do you ball spark? You gotta, you gotta, we gotta get the ball first. Well, which button do I push? Jump? I think it's B, yeah. Oh, well, there's my issue. <laughs> I was pushing bomb. All right, one more time. Yep, yep, yep. Then, like that. No. Don't you dare do an entire full sequence of shine sparking. I know you want to. <laughs> I've seen what you did. You fucker! <laughs> oh, no! Ooh! Ah, uh, well, actually, that's not too bad. So, shoot, slide, and then... Yeah, I have to aim that. See, the cool thing is, is that, uh... Well, I have to get off the bounce. <laughs> Good luck! <laughs> alright, alright, we're gonna be fine. We are going to be a-okay. Oh, come on, get out of the way. I think the high speeds are gone, they're, like, permanently gone. Ha <laughs> 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 Superhero Oops. landing! Uh, yes, I, Samus deserves to have a superhero landing. How the hell am I gonna do this? Try free aiming. Free aiming. Okay. Uh, like, try and shoot it after you go through the door. Or after you chart your store up. Do that. I see. Then roll. No, no, get... And then you'll probably have to... Either get really lucky with uh, with your timing there, or you may have to ball spark in midair, right at the exact. I am down for ball sparking in midair. Would you get the fuck out of my way? Oh, uh, okay. So I did it right. I just did it wrong. Yes. It makes sense when you really think about it. I'm being philosophical here. So well, Metroid Dread brings up the philosophy of everybody. Indeed. Uh, fuck. I, I you, you, could you could probably, uh, hang yeah. on, can, can you just run into that, into that crevice? No. Hmm. Like that? No, that requires pressing the jump button. Ah. Uh. That's how they get you. Uh-huh. Oh, come on, just stay dead. You go, you go too far away so the enemies respawn. I know, it sucks. Alright, here we go. Oh, well, 
This isn't even the one I'm dreading. <laughs> Metroid dreading! <laughs> oh! Bring it home again, Metroid, Metroid. Damn it! I did it again! Wait, how was it? Never mind. Alright, do you just want to cut until I fucking get this? Yeah, you'll get it, you'll get it, you got it. Shit! I did it again! <laughs> ah! Yes! Well, yes! Okay. Yes! Woo! That made no sense. No, I ran out of missiles! Ah! But I'll take it. <laughs> that made no fucking sense because I pressed the button to shine spark and it just made me jump. It just kind of happened. I don't like this shine spark. Well, well done, It's though. inconsistent. All right, where to next? Yes, I'm angry because I'm bad at it. There. Well, you got it, though. I did. Uh-huh. I think that might be our next bet. Okay. Let's head there. Anything here I need to worry about still? Nope, I think we just gotta go the way around. I should hope there's nothing there. Why is my controller all sweaty? <laughs> Why does this feel like regret? It's all clammy. There's tears on it. <laughs> I did it! I did the Metro <laughs> Dread Shine Spark puzzle! Oh my god, no! I, I, you, can't, you, can't, you can't do that willy-nilly. It, it's the greatest day of my life! Greater than starting a YouTube channel? Greater than my graduation? Wow, Greater I've, I've than left. the time I got my Nintendo 64 for the first time! <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I think my best memory is the the GameCube. Because when the when I when my family got the Nintendo 64, it was just like, hey, we got this. No fanfare or anything. It's just like, wow, a new Nintendo! I think I have the most nostalgia for Game Boy Color. Game Boy Color was really good. All right, this looks like there's still stuff up here. Uh -huh. Oh my! Change break. Boosh. Oh, screw attack. It's easy. Uh, you were saying. Okay. Oh, okay. I, uh, yeah, I see what they're doing. Okay. Ew. Uh... Ew. Gross. Ew. No. Oh, I see what they want me to do. That's awful! Okay, I get you. I get you. Oop. Wait, maybe I don't get you. Yeah, what? Hmm. I all think right. you're right. It has to be a power bomb, but probably stand. Wait, what? So. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that. that... No, because you have to be on level ground with it in order to pull it. So you have to be on that set of bomb blocks down there. Hmm. Oh, uh, maybe you... I feel like cross bomb is... Cr cross bomb in the middle of those two, loop around, jump on those bombs. Hmm. See, there you go. Yeah, I think that might be it, but I don't think that'll reach. There you go. And got yeah. it. See, I'm a better puzzle solver than actually doing the fucking puzzles. <laughs> Perfect. All right. And that brings us to Ooh. a potential E tank that I want to try and get. Boom, boom, boom. What? Huh? Ah, ah. <laughs> you, don't, don't do you, that. You, you scared me there. I had, I had a fright. I had a frightened. I did. Oh, here you go. Okay. Where to next? Got 35%. Think we can try and get one more here, maybe. Alright, where? There's another area. That There's looks right there. That, lo that looks pretty promising. Okay, so big old, big old gap there. Down to the right, and then all the way down. Down to the right, together was the light and Down to the right, and down to the right. And down oh, to the right, doing things down that we might. Could you refill, right, though? To... Oh, yeah, I can refill. Like we, you know, in case we need some poo or booms. Give me the sweet. That's an energy refill. Never mind. Give me the sweet juice. Okay, cool. Yeah. I remembered. Okay, I didn't remember that thing. That thing is just mean. Die! 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 
Do I even need to be here? Did I just miss everything? Yeah, I missed everything. Great. That's, I didn't even have to come down here. That's okay. You opened the way, and uh, you, you remembered how storm missiles work. <laughs> that's actually very surprising. Uh, We're all very proud. Everyone clap for this. Yay! The little baby faster, Metroid player knows faster, how to Metro Faster! I don't like that anymore. It's like a way of clap faster. Is. Oh, yeah, the, the double hand clapping. Fastest guy in the world is like a hundred claps. It's madness. Mere seconds. Madness. Okay, so that resulted in nothing. So, is there anything to search for there? It should be. Well, we'd see it then, though, wouldn't we? Mm hmm. So, I'm just going to head over here. I hope, hope you don't mind. Because I saw an area that we haven't completed yet. That looks promising, too. Uh, promising is where I'm going for right now. Oh, this is just leading more to the Emmy zone. Oh, wait! Oh, well, hey. Oh, well, it's, uh, oh, I wasn't wrong. Uh, yeah. Still more of the Emmy zone. Oh! oh! It's a shine spark, isn't it? You better not! Okay. Oh, fuck yeah! <laughs> there we go, power bomb acquired. All right, I think we've, uh, let's see if we can go to our next spot here. 42%, we're almost at... That looks promising. Why don't we get one more to cap it off at 50, and then we'll call it a day. All right. We haven't gotten that yet? No, not yet. Oh, probably needs a power bomb. Okay! Wait, isn't this where, uh, what's-his-beak died? I don't think so. No. Oh, okay. Easy? Boop. Easy! Easy tag! I'm gonna find a safe spot now and get the fuck out of here. Get me out of here! <laughs> get me out of here! <laughs> Classic. Oi! Oi! You motherfucker! Oh, I can't believe that guy. I can't believe it! Alright. So just cut across here, basically, right? And then we'll worry about where we need to go for next time. Don't, don't drown, please. <laughs> Samus' soundtrack that she has, yeah. I was, I was just thinking, yeah, she's humming that soundtrack in her head. Well, next time on Metroid Dored, we're gonna get some more items and get, you know, probably suffer some more on Shine Spark puzzles. Awesome. Exciting. Yeah. Yeah, great. In fact, I think I might Shine Spark right now. Yeah. Ow. Ow. Well, you just took the fun out of it. See you next time.